Well, a different type of legislative session starts tomorrow. There will be no state of the state address from the governor, but new lawmakers will have to be sworn in. And 7 News anchor Kayla Norwood tells us even that process might change. That's right. All of this is unusual and due to COVID-19. I talked to the House Speaker's communications director. He told me that incoming lawmakers might not even be there in person to be sworn in. So in that case, it will have to be done virtually. Folks can expect things to be very different. There are some big changes with the 2021 legislative session because of the pandemic. Republican Representative Rebecca Dow says that includes the public watching remotely and new lawmakers likely getting sworn in remotely too. Sort of feel bad for folks who aren't going to have that experience because it's such it's it's such an incredible moment and it's a celebration uh, for all of us in that chamber, all 70 of us in that chamber. She says back when she was sworn in, she was excited to have her family and friends there on the floor celebrating the hard work volunteers and others put in to get her elected. But newly sworn in Democratic Representative Linda Serrato says the virtual ceremony didn't take away from that big moment for her. This big moment of being sworn in to uphold this oath that, you know, I was so eager to do. Um, and, you know, it was really something special. I had, you know, uh, legislators that were on the floor take some photos for me and things like that. Um, so, you know, that that uh, importance of that moment doesn't change just because you're on a camera instead. Serrata was one of few sworn in in the middle of this pandemic during the special session in November, and she's ready to get the new session started despite the obstacles in place. It's really getting down to the basics, which is we have a big, lot of stuff to do in 60 days and we're just gonna get down to work. So it'll be a, a lot of masks. You know, everyone's gonna be required to wear that. Everyone will be distanced from each other. Um, and, you know, we're to make sure that we are saying the oath that we intend to upkeep. A speaker's communications director tells me there's about a half dozen House lawmakers who need to be sworn in tomorrow. Also on the agenda, they'll be voting on the rule changes that will be in place this session. Reporting in Albuquerque, Kayla Norwood, KOAT Action 7 News. Representative Serrato said the big topics she's looking to address this session include public health and education, economic development, and vaccine distribution.